Let's hear some wisdom from Proverbs chapter 20. Wine is a mocker and beer a brawler. Whoever is led astray by them is not wise. Yes, I know a lot of people affected with alcohol don't drink. Especially if you're a young person listening to this, just say no. A king's wrath is like the roar of a lion. He who angers him forfeits his life. It is to a man's honor to avoid strife, but every fool is quick to quarrel. Verse 4, a sluggard does not plow in season, so at harvest time he looks but finds nothing. Of course, you have to plant if you want to harvest, right? Verse 5, the purposes of a man's heart are deep waters, but a man of understanding draws them out. Many a man claims to have unfailing love, but a faithful man who can find? It's hard, but I found one. Verse 7, the righteous man leads a blameless life. Blessed are his children after him. When a king sits on his throne to judge, he winnows out all evil with his eyes. Who can say, I have kept my heart pure. I am clean without sin. Differing weights and differing measures, the Lord detests them both. I love verse 11. Even a child is known by his actions, whether his conduct is pure and right. I also love verse 12. Ears that hear, eyes that see, the Lord made them both. Do not love sleep or you will grow poor. Stay awake and you will have food to spare. It is no good, it is no good, says the buyer. Then off he goes and boasts about his purchase. Verse 15, gold is there and rubies in abundance, but lips that speak knowledge are a rare jewel. Take the garment of the one who puts up security for a stranger. Hold it in pledge if he does it for a wayward woman. Food gained by fraud tastes sweet to a man, but he ends up with a mouthful of gravel. <laughs> Don't you love that? Make plans by seeking advice. If you wage war, obtain guidance. A gossip betrays a confidence, so avoid a man who talks too much. Verse 20, if a man curses his father or mother, his lamp will be snuffed out in pitch darkness. Verse 22, do not say, I will pay you back for this wrong. Wait for the Lord and he will deliver you. The Lord detests differing weights and dishonest scales do not please him. Verse 24, a man's steps are directed by the Lord. How then can anyone understand his own way? It is a trap for a man to dedicate something rashly and only later to consider his vows. A wise king winnows out the wicked. He drives the threshing wheel over them. Verse 27, the lamp of the Lord searches the spirit of a man. It searches out his inmost being. Love and faithfulness keep a king safe. Through love, his throne is made secure. The glory of young men is their strength, gray hair, the splendor of the old. And verse 30, blows and wounds cleanse away evil and beatings purge the inmost being. More wise words from Proverbs 20. And I would love to answer any questions you may have about faith in Jesus. You can contact me through my website, nancyjoytoyou.com. I hope you have a blessed day living for Him. Mm -hmm.